What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT, and you want to get those spotlight challenges done, hit up my new sponsor DVDJ and use code YOURBOYBUGS for 10% off a checkout. And yeah man, check them out. What's good YouTube, it's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My T video. And guys, today, um, as you can see man, people supposedly got zero MT as their login. I got 20, 225 MT, so it looks like they did fix it. In this video, we'll be going over snipe filters and a little bit of market talk. But yeah, it says top five snipe filters. So we're going to go over some snipe filters for you guys. Make sure to, yo guys, thank you guys for the support. Uh, thank you guys so much for subbing and whatnot. Yo, make sure to drop that sub, man. We've been grinding. And make sure to smash that like button for more content. We'll probably have a video later as well. But yeah, I'm, I'm, this is pre-recorded, bro, right after work. So I am kind of tired. But we're going to go over the market and we're going to talk about some snipe filters and as you can see, man, Tracy McGrady is up a lot. So let's go real quick. Let's get into some snipe filters and whatnot. Let's get this video to 100 likes for another banger, bro. 100 likes will give away 20,000 MT in the comments as well. Um, Make sure to follow me on Twitter because we do the giveaways on there. But yeah, man, without further ado, let's get into it, man. My hair is out of whack. Like, I'm literally sorry. But yeah, without further ado, let's get into some filters. So... I'm going to go over this one because I heard that this one has been so money for everybody and it's been prime VIP, I think, series two. Um, um, you could get Shaq out of it and you could also get D Wade. I mean, Jimmy Butler out of it. So, um, yeah, man, I literally would just recommend putting your buyout to about there. Oh, Jimmy Butler's already under hundred K. So my bad. Um, that's my fault, but I heard that people have been getting a ton of shacks out of this, so they ended up putting their, um, they moved it to Pacific, and they made it just for Shaq, and supposedly, it's been really, really money, so supposedly, a lot of people, a lot of people have been hitting me up that they've been getting a ton of shacks, so just for proof that this filter is pretty fire, I mean, you can literally go check out my Twitter and stuff, because a lot of people have tweeted me out that they have sniped shacks, like, at least 20 people, 15 to 20 people have snub tweeted at me saying that i've gotten shack for 100k so try out this filter it could take a little time but yo if you get shack that's a big w so let me know how it goes and let's get into the next filter so we got the simple amethyst 20 filter that i've been using for so long and it's actually amazing man this filter is straight money it's been money for a really long time and i'm gonna go over it right now you want to look for kevin durant you want to look for Giannis. you want to look for steph curry and you want to look for KD. Um, those are the main players I would like to focus on. You kind of want to stay away from Harden and George because they are really cheap. But yeah, I would set your buyout to around the price I have it at. Unless you want to go cheaper so you don't have to do much scrolling. So yeah, 5200 is a pretty solid price. You pretty much just want to keep refreshing. If you end up getting a Giannis, a Curry, or LeBron, you can make upwards to 10k profit. So 5 to 10k profit. So, if you want to stay on this, man, it's been money for me throughout the whole entire year. One of my most money filters. And when the market crashes, this filter is even better. So, if the market's crashed and you know it's crashed, like crazy packs drop, this filter will make you upwards of 100k in probably one hour. So, try out this filter. It's pretty, pretty, pretty fire. And yeah, let me know how it goes. Another filter that you guys should be trying out. Um, it is Prime... It's not Prime Series 2, it's Prime Series, yeah, it's Prime Series 2, so now, pretty much just want to put your maximum buy to 100k, you know how it goes, looking for Wade and Przingis, anything that pops up, you buy right away, you do not wait any seconds, bro, if you end up copying one of these, you're getting a huge, a huge W, so, make sure to try to get this, I literally, I can't stress this enough, if anything pops up, if you get any of these, man, you're getting over 100,000 profit, no matter what, so, Please listen to me. Try out this filter. Um, personally, I've not gotten anything. People have tweeted me they have sniped a ton of Wades. Like in my comments, man, people are like, I've been sniping Wades and Shacks all day. And man, there's just me sitting here like a bozo getting absolutely nothing, man. So shout out to you guys. Try out this filter. I I'm just not getting it. Everyone's getting these snipes, and I'm sitting here like a bozo getting nothing. But if people are tweeting at me and people are commenting me, that supposedly this filter works. So. Let me know if it works for you guys. I heard it's money. But uh, yeah, <clears throat> without further ado, let's get into the next filter. And uh, this filter is actually pretty good. 
It's actually a really good filter. I've been using it for a really long time as well. That's why I do have so many collected cards because of this filter specifically. And it is Amethyst Simply. Amethyst, like, I would say 2200 Pretty much, let's see what the most expensive, most the cheapest card is in this set. So, right now, Amethyst are around, like, 3K, which is crazy because there's a ton of Brian Reeves for 2K. So, if you did pick a big country for around 2K, let's say you picked up, like, 100 of them, you're going to make a 1,000 profit. You're going to make about 100K off if you picked up 100 Brian Reeves. So, um, pretty solid, I would have to say. But, yeah, right now, man, um, Amethyst are a little... Ooh, that's a snipe. Oh, we missed it. Um, that was a snipe right there. This filter is really, really good. I recommend putting your sh um, your buyouts around 2900 though. But yeah, as you can see, I just missed that land snipe. I could have made a couple thousand off of it. He's actually a pretty good card for a bunch of ballers. But yeah, try this filter, man. It's been working for a solid minute. Um, as long as the amethyst don't go over under a thousand anytime, it's good. But yeah, like I said, man, it's harder to snipe now with no content out. Um... You pretty much just gotta wait till like fire content drops. Like All Star Week is coming, 2K is stalling for All Star Week, so they have something big in plan for sure. They have to have something big in plan. So hopefully they do drop something fire right there. That's a snipe. There we go. We got a snipe real quick for you guys. So 1900 he sells for about four. Gonna make a solid 1500 in about two minutes. So pretty pretty solid if you ask me. I think that's a pretty solid pull right there um next filter man um i'm gonna actually show you in one second um that this silver this, the silver heat check filters are kind of destroyed you could sit on them personally i wouldn't recommend you really need to know like certain cards if you really want to sit on the filters for like you really just gotta wait there and wait for certain cards to pop up do you guys really want to do that probably not but you guys could try out the silver filter it is kind of destroyed their silvers are kind of cheap already but uh, you kind of want to just look for thunder players. That's what I'm. That's what I'm thinking. Or like cards for one thousand is a pretty good deal. So as you can see, it's gone. So if you really want to sell the silver filter, try to get it for under a thousand MT. It's a pretty solid filter. It's just there's really not that much profit margin anymore unless you do get like a thunders player or a kings player. If you don't get really a thunder or kings player, you really get no profit. So that's what I'm thinking. Heat check filter. I'm actually trying to get my heat check collector up right now. But, uh, yeah, man, it's decent. I wouldn't say the heat check filter is anything crazy. I kind of would stay away from it. It's really no profit. And, honestly, with reselling the cards, it could get really stressful. So, honestly, I would recommend not doing it. But, yeah, this filter, um, literally 550. It, it really is 500. But I honestly like 550 more because, I don't know. I feel like who's going to post up a card for 500? I feel like it doesn't really happen. But, uh, yeah, man, try to keep refreshing. I don't know how the refresh works. Maybe you just go up and down on the bid. Like, I don't know how it works. Or maybe you put your, oh, no, you have to put your max bid to 100K and keep going down like that. But, yeah, try out this filter. I heard it's really consistent. Shout out to Logic Looks. I was actually watching his video on this. He said it's really consistent. And then pretty much if you do pick up anything for 550 or under, you could get, um, you could make MT no matter what. So, it's a pretty solid filter. I heard it's consistent. Then again, man, supposedly Xbox sniping is a lot harder than PS4. And honestly, I think it is indeed really, really hard. But yeah, so if you also, if you guys can snipe out Tracy McGrady, if you guys could try. I got him yesterday for 290K. He's going for over 400K now. So I guess that's a dub for me. Personally, I think his price will be dropping for sure. But Honestly, I don't know, man. 2K has been dropping really dry content, but All-Star Moments Weekend. Oh, there we go. I don't think that's really a snipe, but I didn't even get it. So I, I don't even know how I didn't get that. Like, seriously? I literally didn't even get that. I don't even know. I don't know. Who could who's faster than me right there? Xbox is crazy, man. But yeah, that's really all I got. I don't know, man. What do you guys think about these snipe filters? Let me know. I'm just trying to... I was going to check out Tracy McGrady's price for you guys real quick. If you guys were wondering, he's at 378 with... He's going to be about 400K with... Yeah, he's going to sell for about 400K, man. I got him for 270. If I sell him, I make 70K. I mean, I got him for 290. If I sell him, I make 90K. So, no, I make about 70K. So, yeah, man. That's really all I got. If you guys really... If you guys snipe out Tracy McGrady, if you snipe out anything, hit me up on Twitter let me know. But, yeah, guys, that's all I got. 
top five snipe filters really was like top six but yeah that's all i got hope you guys enjoyed the video stay tuned for more content peace